So you clicked on this video because you're probably one of those people that have watched countless videos on how to get a physique like Toji Fushiguro from Jujutsu Kaisen or how to become aesthetic like Baki the Grappler. And I'm here to tell you guys that it's probably time to stop watching those kinds of videos. Now, obviously there's nothing inherently wrong about these types of videos. If they motivate you to get up, get moving, training, working your muscles, having you feel good in your body, they're probably doing you some good. But the problem lies where your motivation is coming from. You click on these types of videos because you want to achieve a God tier anime character type of physique. This is called extrinsic motivation, where you are doing something to gain something from outside of yourself. A majority of the people who start something because they just want to look a certain way usually ends up failing. Now, you could be an anomaly and be part of that 5% of people that watches an anime workout video, goes out, smashes it, and gets their dream physique. But most of you are gonna fail because, let's face it, your motivation is superficial. So how do we fix the problem? What you have to do is shift your identity, who you are at a base level, to becoming someone who has the intrinsic motivation to work out. Intrinsic motivation is when you do something because you love to do it. It's a part of who you are and you get enjoyment from it. Not because you think having a nice body is gonna fix all your fucking problems. Let's take Goku for example, the GOAT. Number one. Yo, I just realized I missed the patch on, of my beard. Fuck. Anyways, yeah, yo, take Goku for example, right? He doesn't train hard for the sake of having a great body. He trains hard because he wants to fortify his body in order to become a better fighter because he loves to fight. This dude dreams and like, you know, goes crazy over the thought of facing a very tough opponent. The physique, his body is just a byproduct of fortifying his body for what he loves to do. You get what I'm saying? Y'all follow? And if you look at all shonen main characters across the board, their motivations are more or less the same. Like, they train hard because they have to in order to be the best version of themselves. And they generally enjoy it. They get satisfaction from training because it's a part of who they are. It's a part of who we are. And here, your bum ass is just looking at how to get certain physique videos so you can attract some girls at an anime convention or something like that, like the shoujo creep that you are, instead of being a real shonen MC, training for a greater cause, like being the best in the world at something. So. If you wanna fix this about yourself, that's okay, that's great. You know, self-awareness is the key. Here's your action item. Take 15 minutes out of the day and meditate on why you really want to have a dope anime character physique. And then shift your identity and tell yourself, I am this type of person because I want to do this and my body is just a byproduct of what my greater purpose is. This will change your life for the better from just a spiritual context. And it's gonna make getting the anime body a lot easier because yo, it's just a byproduct of you doing what you're supposed to be doing because you love to do it. And in the process, yo, you might become someone that changes the fucking world. You never know. And that's the most important thing in life. Anyways, I trust that, you know, this message helped change your mentality when it comes to training. But yeah, I'm gonna cut it right there. I'm about to, you know, hit a training session myself for what I love to do. And yeah, yo, subscribe to the channel because I'm cooking up a lot more content like this that'll help you guys become the main character of your own life. And, you know, maybe I'll put out other content that's just fun to watch, right? Maybe you guys will enjoy that. 
<laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment. Tell me what you guys think. And, you know, tell me what you're fighting for in your life. Tell me what you're working towards. Let's uh, get a conversation going. All right? Catch you guys in the next one.